the EPOS thematic core service on anthropogenic hazards aims to create new research opportunities in the field of anthropogenic hazards related to the exploration and exploitation of geo resources. This has been accomplished by the integration of five main elements IS data, visualization tools, document repository, services, and user workspace. The TCS AH platform is based on the prototype built within the IS EPOS project financed from Polish structural funds. The platform is being developed further within the EU Horizon 2020 EPOS IP project. The TCS is designed as a functional e-research environment. The platform provides virtual access to integrated datasets, which comprehensively describe induced seismicity cases called episodes of induced seismicity. After entering the episode browser, you can review all of the available datasets. Some basic information about the chosen episode is displayed. You can view data graphically on a map, including earthquake locations, mine areas, station positions, and mining advanced polygons. And depending on the selected episode, reservoir shoreline, borehole trajectory, fault positions, focal mechanisms, and the data stored in a GIS format. You can view the data as histograms, simple, cumulative or reverse, 2D histograms, 1D and 2D plots with a secondary y-axis, plots with seismic activity, 3D plots. You can download the generated plots and view the seismic catalogue which can also be downloaded. Each episode consists of time-correlated seismic and technological data, which can be visualized in 3D. Special tools are adapted to present the specified multidimensional datasets. You can use these to compare measured parameters with each other. You can also choose the code name of the station you are interested in, stage of monitoring, or the measurement method. Results can be shown by time, monitoring stage or code name of the station. Detailed documentation is provided for each episode. For example, articles, reports, images, book sections, conference or workshop items. The IS EPOS platform provides seamless access to integrated services. You can use low-level software services for data browsing, selection and visualization. These include the magnitude conversion tool, which can be used to establish relationships between different magnitude scales. The GDF and Catalog Export tool, which allows you to export data as a spreadsheet file. The Waveform Download tool, which allows you to select parts of continuous waveforms for specific dates and stations. And there are other tools too. There are a number of high-level services for advanced data processing. This is a collection of problem-oriented, specific services, with particular emphasis given to services facilitating analysis of relationships between technological parameters and geophysical response. You have a workspace to store data along with the preliminary and final results of the processing. The workspace can be customized by creating folders. Files can be moved or renamed and folders can be deleted. You can download files. Files can be used in services and visualization tools. You can upload your files to the workspace and then process the data using the TCS platform tools. TCSAH will provide the public sector with expert knowledge and background information.